हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू फाइव मिनट्स कोड चैनल वेयर आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग द सॉल्यूशन ऑफ एवरी प्रॉब्लम ऑफ लीड कोड एंड गीक्स और गीक्स विद इन लेस देन फाइव मिनट्स सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड टुडेस प्रॉब्लम इज के एथ मिसिंग पॉजिटिव नंबर इन अ सॉल्टेड एरे व्हिच इज मार्क एज अ मीडियम लेवल प्रॉब्लम लेट्स फाइंड आउट व्हाट वी विल बी गिवन इनटू दिस प्रॉब्लम एंड व्हाट वी हैव टू डू सो बेसिकली वी विल बी गिवन वन एरे ए आर आर एंड वन इंटीजर के एंड लेट्स सी व्हाट दिस सिग्निफाइज सो ए आर आर Uh, array is a sorted array with distinct positive integers sorted array with distinct positive integers means ki first of all array will be sorted in ascending order and second thing all the elements will be contained only once will be existing only once in the array and what does this k means k means we need to find the kth positive number that is missing from array we need to find kth positive number that is missing from array okay so kth positive number what does this mean suppose here you can see 2 3 4 7 11 is an uh, our array and k is equal to 5 so it means we have to find out the fifth positive number that is missing okay so if you will see the first number first positive number that is missing is 1 because 1 is not there after that 2 is there 3 is there 4 is there but 5 is not there 5 is not there okay so 5 is the second missing number then there is 6 is also not there so 6 is the third then there is 7 is present okay then there is 8 which is the fourth missing number then there is 9 so 9 is the fifth missing number and i will simply return 9 okay all right similarly similarly you can see this array a r r 1 2 3 and k is equal to 2 so here also what are the missing positive numbers so 1 2 3 are present 4 is missing 5 is missing 6 is missing and then keep on continuing continue continue okay so second missing number second missing positive number is 5 so we will return 5 okay all right similarly here so here 1 and 2 both are not present and i have to give the second positive number that is missing that will be 2 that will be 2 okay all right so now this is our problem statement this is what problem statement means now let's think how can we solve this look first solution which is uh, brute force coming in my mind is what i will do is i will simply have one variable uh, yeah so what i will do is i will simply have one variable that is missing num count and uh, i will simply start a loop from one i will simply start a loop from one and i will check if one is present yes so increase both counter and the number and this index as well so Uh, let's say my current index is this uh, index is at zero index okay so what should be the expected value expected value will be i will be showing here okay and miss counter let's say i will have here okay miss counter i will add have here so it is currently zero expected value at zero index should be one but it is two it is two it means one number is missing it means one number is missing so whenever one number is missing i will add one to miss okay and now what is the expected value expected value is 2 okay all right after that again yeah 2 is present so increase the pointer to 3 here and now 3 and this counter will also be increased to 3 yes it is again there so now uh, move to next pointer that is 4 okay so now counter is also increased to 4 4 is also present 4 is also present now move on to next 7 and now this counter will be move to 5 will do move to 5 okay all right how this 5 is, is there look so what i am saying is at uh, ideally ideally at this index there should be four if no numbers are missing if no numbers are missing ideally at this index three index number should be four but since one number is missing since i have counted one number is missing the expected value should be five expected value should be five but no five is also not there seven is there okay it means two more numbers are missing it means two more numbers are missing okay so now i will add two more misses sorry earlier it was one now it will become 1 plus 2 okay all right so now 7 is there okay expected value is 5 so now uh, on adding missing two number three numbers from here so i will get what i will get 8 okay so expected value should be 8 expected value should be 8 here okay all right now i will move to next index 11 okay so now 11 uh, current value is 8 so three more numbers are missing three more numbers okay so you can see ki now 8 should be there but 8 is not there so what i will do i will increase the counter missing number by 1 now uh, current value will become 
okay so again i will check okay so it was it was, should be 7 now 8 and 9 so now uh, one more missing number will be there 2 3 4 5 okay so fifth missing number is what 9 fifth missing number is what 9 i will simply return 9 Okay, so this is one approach, but it is not a good approach because it will take a lot of time. So we can minimize it. We can minimize it. How we can minimize? Uh, we can minimize using binary search. We can minimize using binary search. How? Look, I know my uh, starting index. I know my ending index. And at any point, at any point, wherever my mid is, wherever my mid is, I can tell, I can tell uh, my answer will be lying before mid or after mid okay how let me show you let me show you look let's say my beginning is at zero okay my beginning is zero my end is at uh, last index zero one two three four four okay all right and now what will be our uh, result look my max result can be what can be our max result at any point max result at any point will be arr dot length plus k arr dot length plus k that is 10 okay max result can be this only it cannot be greater than this because if you will try to fill this five length array at any time like anywhere any you know, with any numbers and k is equal to 5 so our answer cannot exceed 10 our answer cannot exceed 10 because look if i will fill 1 2 3 4 5 okay 1 2 3 4 5 all are filled now fifth five numbers are filled and after that i have to skip four more numbers i have to skip four more numbers and then return the fifth missing number okay so five and after that missing four new numbers will become nine okay and uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 are filled. Okay. And now k equal to 5. So what maximum number can be there? 10. Maximum result can be 10. Okay. All right. So now that I will uh, have as already have. So at uh, starting point, our answer will be arr dot length plus k. Okay. Because uh, in the worst case, as I told, if I will fill this array with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, in that case also the our missing number, fifth missing number will be 10. Okay. And in any case, it cannot be greater than 10. Okay. All right. So what I will do is very very simple. I will simply calculate the mid. I will simply calculate the mid. So mid at here will be 4. Okay. So how can I find out? How can I find out my answer? My uh, missing at 4. Uh, if at any index at uh, let's say 2 index which is 4. How many missing positive numbers are there? How many missing positive numbers are there before uh, at 4? Okay. So look. If there are no missing numbers, what should be the ideal number present here? What should be the ideal number here? If there are no missing numbers, so 1, 2, 3. Here it should be 3. Here it should be 3. But currently it is 4. Currently it is 4. So it means there is one missing number. It means there is one missing number. Okay. There is one missing number. All right. I hope till this point it is very, very clear. But I have to find the fifth missing number. I have to find the fifth missing number. So fifth missing number will be on the right side because on the left side until this point, till this second index, there is only one missing number. And how I'm finding that I've already told you. So after that, I will again move to, uh, let's say, if I move to right side, beginning will be equal to uh, mid plus one. Beginning is equal to mid plus one. So zero, one, two, three. Beginning will become three now. Okay, beginning will become three. Okay, all right. Again, uh, let's say, let me delete all these things first of all. Okay, so now uh, 3. This is our beginning. This is our end. And this will be our mid as well. Okay, alright. 7 is our mid. So, at 7, are there 5 missing positive numbers? How can I find out? Look, if there are no missing numbers, what should be ideally here? It should be 1, 2, 3, 4. It should be 4. Okay, current is 7. It means there are three missing numbers. There are three missing numbers. Okay. But I have to get five. I have to get five. Okay. So again, what I will do? I will simply do beginning is equal to mid plus one. So now uh, beginning will become four as well. Okay. All right. Now our beginning will become four. Okay. After that, uh, what will be the mid? After that, what will be the mid? Mid will be this as well. Okay. Mid will be 11. Okay. All right. So look. Now one more very, very important thing is key mid is 11. 
mid is 0 1 2 3 4 mid is fourth index okay and now what can be our answer so look at 11 first of all what i will tell is ki 11 uh, is present ideally ideally it should be 5 ideally it should be 5 because 1 2 3 4 5 so ideally it should be 5 but it is 11 it means there are six missing numbers it means there are six missing positive numbers okay i hope till this point it is clear there are six missing positive numbers but uh, i have to forget what i have to get fifth only i have to get fifth only but now here it is six missing numbers so where i should be checking i should be checking in the left side i should be checking in the left side how can i check in the left side end is equal to mid minus one so end will become three end will become three okay all right but look while moving end i will update my result as well so at any point if uh, i have to go to left side my result will be equal to mid plus k mid plus k so mid here is 0 1 2 3 4 4 and k 5 9 okay it is 9 so our result is 9 all right after that when i will check oh my end is now less than beginning end is less than beginning it means our binary search has ended and i will simply return 9. okay so this is what i have to do this is what i have to do okay I hope till this point it will be very very clear and now how res result is coming as mid plus k let me tell you that as well how result is coming as mid plus k so let's uh, delete all these things and let's move on to the next example this 3 5 9 10 11 12 okay so uh, here again beginning is 0 okay ending is what ending is 0 1 2 3 4 5 and uh, result at any point what can be the maximum result as i told maximum result will be arl dot length 6 plus k 8 okay so at any point ans our answer cannot be greater than 8 if i have to miss two positive numbers well look two positive numbers i have to miss okay and currently there are six numbers so even if all the six numbers are present then 7 I will miss and 8 I will return. Okay, so that's why my result is 8 at this point. All right, so now uh, let's take the pen. And now beginning is 0, end is 5. So mid will be what? Mid will be 2. Mid will be 2. Okay. All right, so 2, 0, 1, 2. This at 9. Now look at 9. Uh, how many missing numbers I am having? How many missing numbers I am having? So ideally it should be 1, 2, 3. Ideally 3 should be present here. But it is 9. It means there are 6 numbers, 6 positive numbers that I have missed. But I have to find only second missing number. But this 9 is 6th missing number. Okay. So no, I will not... Uh, I will not move to right side i have to move to left side i have to move to left side so to move to left side what will be my end end will be mid minus one that is one end is equal to mid minus one that is one and one more thing i will update my result result new result new expected result it can be is mid plus k okay because if you remember at any point and the starting what i did was result dot length plus k result dot length plus k and here at that any point let's say this is 9 so mid here will be what mid here will be 2 and k will also be 2 4 okay so at this point if i am stopping at this point if i am stopping my answer cannot be greater than 4 my answer cannot be greater than 4 so that's why our answer for this will become 4 for now for now okay again so beginning is 0 end is 1 now what will be our what will be our uh, mid mid will be 0 mid will be 0 because beginning is 0 end is 1 so mid is 0 okay 3 again i will check what should be the ideal number present here ideal number present here should be 1 but here it is 3 it means two missing numbers are there it means two missing numbers are there okay so again what i will do mid plus k mid is 0 k is 2 so now my result will become 2 okay again i have to move to left side so again now my end will become what uh, mid minus 1 that is minus 1 okay so my loop is ended and now what is my answer my answer is 2 I hope it will be very very clear to you if yes please subscribe the channel and like the video and uh, share your feedbacks as well now i am going to write the code for it okay now let's write the okay all right now let's write the code for it so first of all low will be zero high will be arr dot length minus one and uh, my answer at any point if you remember i told it will be arr dot length plus k max max answer can be arr dot length plus k 
okay all right so now it will be it is very simple while low is less than equal to i first of all what i will do i will calculate mid so mid is equal to low plus high divide by 2 okay and now if you remember what i told i have to check at any point at mid at mid how many missing numbers are there and if those missing numbers are greater than k okay so what i will do is arr of mid is greater than is greater than what mid plus k okay okay this means arr mid is greater than mid plus k this means ki are there missing numbers are missing numbers greater than k or missing numbers greater than k how so remember it was 9 arr mid was 9 okay mid is what mid is 0 1 2 2 and k is 2 as well okay 4 so four numbers but uh, arr mid is 9 arr mid is 9 and uh, i have to only get two missing numbers second missing number second missing number but currently there are uh, nine is present here and ideally it should be three so there are six missing numbers there are six missing numbers okay so to overcome this to overcome six missing numbers what i will do i will simply move to left side and to move to left side what i will do is very very simple uh, high is equal to mid minus one and if you remember i also told to update our answer answer will be what answer will be equal to mid plus k because ideally it should be mid plus k okay otherwise if it is correct if it is if, uh, if this condition is false here you can see for four this condition is false because uh, number of missing positive numbers is not greater than k at this mid at this mid number of missing positive integers is not greater than or equal to k so now what i will do i have to move to right side i have to move to right side how to move to right side low is equal to mid plus one okay all right and at last what i will do i will simply return my answer let's try to submit this once i hope uh, you have got this it's actually it's a bit tricky to explain as well but uh, okay ah sorry i cannot have space between them i guess so now let's again try to submit this meanwhile if you have loved the explanation Please don't forget to subscribe the channel and like the video and I have made a very cool Chrome extension for you as well. So that comment, that link will you will get in the pinned comment where on clicking of this watch tutorial button, you can see the tutorials on this window only instead of going to YouTube and see. Okay. All right. So yeah, that was it for today. I'm going to see you again tomorrow. Till then, keep on coding and